Use any ATM of your convenience and stand a chance to win gold sovereigns. Lanka Pay. The Sri Lanka Railway Station Masters Union launched a strike action from midnight yesterday over several demands. As a result, several trains including the night mails to and from Fort Badulla, Trincomalee, Batiklo and Ramukana were cancelled massively inconvenience in the public. Sri Lanka Railways warned the striking station masters and railway controllers that if they fail to report to duty, they will be considered as having vacated their positions since public transport including Sri Lanka's railway service has been listed as an essential service. Despite the announcements made by Sri Lanka Railways, the train strike continued this morning. Several train trips were cancelled while limited train services remained operational. General Manager of Sri Lanka Railways SS Mudalige revealed that 80% of train services were disrupted this morning due to the train strike. Additionally, the Ministry of Transport and Highways stated that necessary steps were taken to provide free transport on SLTB buses for the passengers who have obtained train season tickets. As the strike proceeds undeterred, Sri Lanka Railways issued their final warning informing that all striking railway service employees who fail to report to duty by 12 noon today will be considered to have vacated their positions. However, the striking railway workers remain determined to continue their strike action. In the meantime, the customs trade unions initiated a work to rule campaign recently over the amendments which are to be brought to the customs ordinance. The unions alleged that there is a plan to merge Sri Lanka Customs, the Inland Revenue Department and the Excise Department and hand over their powers to a private entity. In the wake of the ongoing strike campaigns, the Container Transport Associations pointed out that 3,000 to 4,000 containers are currently held up at the Colombo port. They further reveal that against such a backdrop, it is possible for the haulage charges to be raised by 10%. The customs trade unions, however, added that the container clearance will revert to normalcy within a span of a week.